Hello everyone, how are you all doing? Good afternoon from my side here and good morning and good evening also depend on where you are watching me from and when you see this video, you are highly welcome back to my YouTube channel. Thank you very much for coming around. If you are new, hello, you are highly welcome. My name is Promise and please don't go, don't watch and go. Consider clicking on the red button subscribe and turn on the bell notification and select all so that you will always get notified whenever i upload a new video if you are a return subscriber thank you very much darlings for coming back remember i really really love you without you there will no be this channel so may the good lord bless you okay all right if you are new this channel is all about using the natural things of creation of god to get rid of so many things in our life to get our desire done and to achieve our aim in life so thank you for coming around to this channel all right like you said i titled this video the message of life so i want us to understand something about this life and i want you to also understand that when you want to use any of the recipe what you need to know and your understanding and your faith is what gives you an answer to your request or whatever you are praying for really i created this channel with purpose like i said i don't just come to make video because i want you to watch me know or i want to get views no this motivated me most a lot because of the testimonies of people in this channel so and is god all true and i say may his name be praised all right and in life until you understand the areas of your life the areas of your calling the the purpose which you have been created i you are not going to achieve anything that is why you see in life a lot of people they pass through so many things some people they fight just one issue for years without getting an answer yes and let me tell you, in life, there is something that you keep doing, doing it years one, years two, years three, and you see you are not getting positive results from there. You are not making a good impact from this. What you need to do is just to depart and change another dimension and change another way. You will see maybe by the grace of God, when you do it in another way, you get a perfect result. All right. Why I want to make this video, please... Follow me to the end of this video. I promise you are going to learn a lot of things and you're going to understand more tips about this life. Okay. You know, a lot of people, some of them, they will just come and ask me what if, if I try this recipe after which I stop it, will it come back to me and all that? Some will be like, eh, why must you pray with this and that and that? Let me tell you, even in the Bible, in the book of genesis you can read it so you will understand you know exactly when you want to pray you focus your attention then you have faith and you see answer to whatever you are praying for in genesis chapter 1 verse 29 i want you to read from 29 to the end which is the 31 god said that he has created everything giving it unto us for food for things he created her he created greens he created all these things and he gave it unto you unto you and i that is watching me so what do you expect even god created everything he said to adam name them whatever you call them that is what they are and whatever adam called them or mentioned that they, this is what they are this is what they are so that is the authority you have that is the privilege you have over things created by god because you are both them because when you use it for your own good for your own bad it works for you have you imagined in the most cases like all these uh, evil people they will just use an image and scatter they will just get an image of a plastic rubber or whatever they will just scatter marriage they will use it to do so many evil to people and it works because of the attack Attach faith to it because they value that thing because they just put it as a representative. And when they do that thing, if you like being in all over the world, wherever the world ends that you are, the thing will be manifesting in your life. 
So all these things is what you need to understand. Don't come and start telling me, uh, is this thing, and uh, why will I pray with you? Please, this is, is not by force, but I thank God Almighty because of the testimonies. And I thank God because a lot of life are being transformed for good. A lot of life are being as they been achieved their aims on life. Sometimes I wake up with a lot of testimonies. Oh my God, it gives me joy. It motivates me. It gives me courage to come back again to cheer because I know my joy is that a lot of people are being out of bondage. A lot of people are being, being a lot of people are achieving their aims in life. I told you we are in a wicked world. A lot of things is happening because you are alive. Somebody may not be happy because your business is going through. Your, somebody may not be happy because your marriage is prospering. Somebody may not be happy because your husband loves you. Somebody may not be happy. And you see, maybe they will start planning evil against you to scatter you. So have you sit yourself down and ask yourself, why is this, this manifesting in my life? Why is things suddenly turn for me? Why is this that maybe a lot of people are passing so many negative things in life because they understand that when they use so 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 thing and do so 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 it works and that is why i tell you all the things created is for your own good and is for your own bad some people are using it for good and some people are using it for good but i plead with you to be among those that is using it for good i told you if you want to try any of this recipe and your hands are clean my dear you don't need to have double mind you don't need to start thinking you don't just do it go and lie down go and even lie down and sleep you are seeing the answer manifesting immediately because your hands are clean because your neighbor is prospering you are not angry because you are not planning evil against somebody because you are not thinking of killing anybody your heart are pure and when you use all those things it works let me tell you even if you are praying when you keep praying, 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 and the prayer, you see that you kept praying without getting an answer. My dear, change dimension. You can start with a seed. And most of the times, try to tap grace from people that is greater than you. It works. You know, a lot of us, they may be thinking they want to cut money from me. No, not if you cannot do. Go to less privilege, go to orphanage, go to beggar. Sometimes, so seed to people. It opens door. It makes things to start working. If you see somebody that you are better than and you are in, you have enough, please go and help that person. There are a lot of people, a lot of us, we have enough food that we may eat it in our house and throw it away. Where there is some people in their house that cannot even afford two square meal a day, and you, because God makes a way for you, because things are working for you, your business, your your conditions, everything are working. You eat, and the one you remain, you pack it and go and throw it away. Let me tell you, you are just calling poverty to come because there is some family that are dying out of hunger. This is a principle of life. And again, most of us that claim that, uh, why will I play with this tea? Why will I play with uh, alligator pepper? Why would these are the creation of God? That is where I am going. I just want you to understand. I had a lot of testimony. Okay, from now on, I'm going to create a perfect group. Maybe because of our number and more, I'm going to create this group on Telegram. We will be sharing testimonies. I will be sharing the testimony. So you will see that we are not playing. You will see that a lot of life are transforming for good. You will see that a lot of marriages are coming together. You will see that a lot of doors are opening. So we are not here to play. If you think that we are here maybe to entertain you, I have other many reasonable things to do than that but most of the time when i look at the testimony when I, even when i think i'm quitting i will not have rest of mind until i come to cheer so i am not here to tell you what i know is not going to work for you whatever recipe i shared here please go and do it according to the way it was said believe me that was shared in this channel please go and do it according to where it was said please, so that you will come back and give your own testimony. And another thing is don't compare anybody together. Don't compare me with other people. Don't compare other people with me. Let me tell you, in the journey of life, everybody with his own destiny. In life, you, yourself, and anybody has its own destiny. My In my language, we used to say, something of that. 
that your mother gave birth to you people, 10, does not mean that because you are the eldest one, you'll be the one that will have millions in that family. It's not done that way. It's, you may be the one, but it's not done that way. Everybody come into this life with different destiny, with different glory, and with different many things like seriously that's why in life there's some people that you come in contact with things will open for you those will open and there's some you will come in contact with things will start going back business will close frustration every bad thing will start happening it doesn't mean that those people are the cause but just because on the they was born with it because their created was i don't know how to put it until they are cleansed themselves out of that. You start seeing a good energy coming out of them. All right. So I just want to understand the principle of life. Wherever you are praying with any of this recipe, I do say it in my videos. Pray to whatever you believe on. Me, I pray to my God, God Almighty, the creator of the whole universe. And he answers me. I, I you know. And again, I want to tell you one thing. Know God for yourself. This is very, very important. Know God for yourself. Don't know God to entertain anybody. Don't, ne don't know God to please anybody unless you will remain at a place forever. A lot of us will go to church. We are just looking at when pastor will come before we start dancing so that people, pastor will see that we are dancing. You are just fooling yourself. Or maybe you go to the church, pastor did not come. You felt bad. Uh, why did I come today? Are you going for pastor? You are just going in for yourself. Just know God for yourself. A lot of things, there are some things that a lot of people maybe after, maybe they sleep and wake up, maybe they had some strange dream. Instead of them to stand on their feet, stand on their feet and pray and cancel that dream, they will just start calling, Pastor, going, running here and there, running here and there. You are deceiving yourself. Please know God to yourself. I had a woman telling me, promise, when I was praying with uh, Tedri, uh, my neighbor was telling me, uh, my pastor do this, my pastor do that. And because of that, she stopped. I said, congratulations. Did you know what? Because she doesn't know what she wants. She just wants to please somebody. Let me tell you, when you're doing that, you're not worshiping God. The God we see, we did not see him. We only believe that he exists. And when we call upon him, he answer us. So you need to know God by yourself. Don't know God to please even your husband, your wife, your pastor, anybody. Be whom you are. And another thing in life is this. Not because you see somebody on the road, because this is what I observe mostly in this our own generation you will see a lot of people maybe they tied their hair with rubber they don't wear earrings they don't wear necklace they don't make up they don't do anything and when they see a sister maybe that put on a uh, makeup that put on earring and all that they will be saying she's an unbeliever and she doesn't know god she's a sinner she's this but when you come closer to them or more you are going to run away let me tell you you are deceiving yourself you are not doing it for me. So please, know God for yourself. You don't judge people because of their physical appearance. You don't judge people because they, they, they wear makeup and you don't wear makeup. Or they wear trousers and you wear long printed skirts. You don't know people on that until you come closer to them. Let me tell you, people will only know you by your character. People will only know you by your sincerity. When somebody comes to you, you will see that Christ in you. Not you being seeing Christ by your dressing, you wearing masquerade and you are claiming you are a holy person. Is not done that way. Please know God to yourself. Don't know God to in place anybody. Don't know God because know God for you, to anybody. If you want to know God, know God to yourself. Be, whatever you want to do, if you want to do something and your spirit, always listening to your inner spirit, tells you, do this, my dear, do it, you will get an answer. But if you want to do something and you are not comfortable of that thing you want to do, your spirit tells you, judging you and all that, you try to hear your inner spirit. I got a wonderful testimony that gave me joy today. Like I said, from now, I will drop the link, join our testimony group. You are going to see that we are not playing here. You are going to see that a lot of lives have been transformed for good. All right. All this is a creation of God. Even in the Bible, it came to a place that the, the village was bitter. Their water causes miscarriage. And when Elijah come there, he said, give me a salt. 
When a salt was given to him, he prayed in that salt and poured it in that water and the water become pure. It, does not, it doesn't mean that he doesn't have power. He's a man full of power. He's a man full of the Holy Spirit. He has authority to say, I oh, have you this water. Do I have turned to be sweet, be this, be this, but he requested for salt to show you these are the creation of God because God has given it to us for a purpose to use it to get our problem solved. Unless you want to use it to do something that is not good, something that is not genuine, something that is not good, you know that you're on your own. I tell you, nothing goes, everything that goes up comes down. So that is why you need to keep your head clean in everything you are doing in life. And if you are a type, maybe you are you always cheat people, you always uh, try to get everything to yourself. You know, a lot of somebody chatted me, said, uh, Lady P, I want something, I want to go to I will not mention the particular place, but I just want to give you some clue. And uh, please, I know I am guilty, yes, I am guilty, but I want you to give me something that or tell me what I will do. Uh, even if I am guilty, everybody will be talking on my behalf so that the other person will be persecuted. Can you imagine the world we are? You are guilty instead of you to ask for forgiveness, instead of you to say, Oh, I'm sorry of that. You still want to commit more and more evil on what you are doing. You are guilty and you want people to talk on your behalf and persecute somebody that is innocent. And you expect, you think that after doing that, that it will not come back. Let me tell you, there is nothing you do that will not come. It's nation. Even if you like be a born again, even if you like be evangelist, even if you like be a prophet, even if you like do be the most holy somebody, whatever you do in this life, we are must surely come back. You may do it unknowing and let her repent. Is nation you must pass through the consequences, but maybe because you repented, maybe because your sincerity to God, because maybe your love for God or whatever, it may be lesser. But let me tell you, you must pass through the consequence of whatever you do. There is no two ways about it. You may not pass through it, it may be waiting for your children. Let me be honest. That's why you see a lot of people, a lot of fathers that have done evil before when they died. Their, their children that is coming up, that is supposed to be progressing, supposed to be making way in life, things will start going back to them because they are suffering what that was done by their fathers. So there is nothing you do in life that does not have consequences. So that is why you need to keep your hands very clean. You need to keep your way straight. Don't harm anybody. Don't think evil against anybody. So that when you want to pray, you get an answer to whatever you are praying for. So please, I want you to understand the principle of life. And again, before I close this, know God to, for yourself. No God for yourself, my dear. No God for yourself. Don't know God to entertain anybody. Don't know God to, to deceive anybody because you are only deceiving yourself. Okay? So please, I just want to make this thing to be so understandable to everybody. If you want to try any of the recipe, you think you are not convinced with it, good and fine. You can skip to other ones you felt you are okay with. But I am assuring you is that all these things is a creation of God. He created them. He gave them under you for your own use. And when you use it in a right way, in a good way, or in a normal way, you get an answer to whatever you are praying for. All right, so please, I wish to share this with you. Understand the principle of life so that things will start working for you. Long ago, we have been dying in ignorance. Thank God to our life today. Things are being improved by the grace of God. People are just getting solved to what getting solved to their problem. This era is not when you start going to place to place and all that your own. You just keep your hands clean, pray to God. Pray to whatever you believe on and you see the answer of whatever you are praying. Thank you, my beautiful family. So I wish to share this recipe. I have reason of sharing this. Please put this thing into practice 
and see your life being transformed for good, seeing your desires being manifest the way you planned them. All right, thank you very much, my beautiful family. Like I do say, don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you're not yet subscribed. We have a lot to learn together, okay? And also, please give this video a thumbs up if you love the video. Please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also share to your loved ones, to your family, so that all of us will benefit. Please, like I said, if you're not yet follow me on instagram please support me also click on i will also share my instagram handle follow me other teachings are going on in instagram and like i said our telegram group will be open soon so thank you very much my beautiful family stay blessed and see you in my next video bye